What's up guys, it's your girl Shirley and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing something a little bit different, a little bit more hypebeast. And we're going to be opening the Off-White Jitney bag. So this one is the Off-White 1.0 Jitney crossbody bag. And I've already opened the box and everything. I got it as a present for my birthday and I really love it. It's beautiful. I haven't really seen a lot of videos about this bag or even a lot of, about a lot of other really cool bags that off-white has and i just wanted to share this with you guys so yeah let's get on to the video so upon first glance of getting the box this is what the box looked like it's the typical off-white color the light sage green color that we have here and he has this new motif design on the box and this is actually a guy with his hands up in the air and i didn't realize that before and I just realized that not too long ago, so that's pretty interesting. And also on the box, we have these little circle cutouts. He has been having this circle kind of design for a while, you know, with the meteor bags and all that kind of stuff. And if you compare this box with the box that he had previously, in this box, we have the binder clip bag, and you can see the difference. This one is a lot more plain and simple. It has quote-unquote bag box on the top and his little writing. And over here, he doesn't say quote-unquote, but he just says in plain text, bag box. So, yeah. So let's just open up the box. And inside the box, we have this little dust bag over here. This one is a muslin dust bag. And normally he has the plastic dust bag where it literally says quote unquote plastic on the front, but this one was a little bit different. So if we open the bag. Okay guys, so here is the bag. Isn't it pretty? It's so nice. I love it. So this bag, like I said, is the Jitney 1.0 cross body bag. And it comes in many different colors. It can come in black, white, um, burgundy, and I'm not too sure about the other colors, but I know those three for sure. And this bag comes in a variety of prices. You can get it from $950 all the way up to $1,000. It just depends on the bag that you get. Some bags come with a handle at the top, others don't. In my case, I don't have a handle. It's just this strap, which is the cross body strap. And other bags come also with different motif at the bottom. So this one says not for sale, and others would say salary inside, cash inside, Virgil was here, even though that one is a little bit extra. I wouldn't get that one, but yeah, you get the idea. But yeah, so there's writing on the bag. You see it says turn to open. And this bag, it doesn't turn to open. It's a magnetic button. Other bags does do that feature. It's just that it's a little bit more expensive. And in the back, we have a pocket that literally says pocket on it. It's a pretty tight fit. You can fit some stuff in there. I don't think a phone would fit very good in here since phones are pretty thick but you can fit like a couple cards or like tickets or whatever you would need and on the inside of the bag is actually pretty roomy it has a lot of room inside of it and with my other bag that i have which is the binder clip bag you can't really fit a lot of stuff inside you know you can fit like your phone a lip gloss and a couple cards and whatnot and then this one you can fit a whole bunch of other stuff and I'm going to be showing you guys what could actually fit in here okay so what does fit in this bag you ask say no more so I'm just going to put in my wallet right onto the side right there I'm going to put my phone I'm going to put my AirPods case. It's a cute little retro stereo AirPods case. If you guys like it, I'll put the link in the description down below for you guys to check it out. Super cute. So I'm going to put that right there. And I still got room. So I'm going to put my hand sanitizer. I'm going to put my Fenty Beauty lip gloss and my mask since we're in the new world. And now we're just going to close it up and bam 
it all fits nice and snug there's no swelling on the bag at all it just fits perfectly and you can do that with the binder clip bag the small one at least so yeah for this video i hope you guys enjoyed this bag is beautiful and if you guys are going to get it you're going to love it i guarantee it i have like so many outfits planned for this bag i can't wait and it's going to be put up on my lookbook so you guys are going to see it it's on my website i'll put the link down in the description and yeah so that's a wrap be sure to check out my other videos i make other fashion related content you know sewing unboxings vlogs fashion shoots all that kind of stuff and if you guys have any ideas of what other videos i should come out with then let me know down in the comments i would like to check that out and see what i can do so yeah i'll see you guys in the next video bye